This is the Filipino with it all the big hits. Information, entertainment, all the past. The Filipino, the Filipino with it. Dubai Eye 103.8. 3.8, we got six minutes past two o'clock. That's Asian girls, proud to be one, and the artists. Wow, they're in front of me. Ladies and gentlemen, welcome to the studios, Warson Ivy. Hello, guys. Hey, how you doing? Good morning. Good morning. Good morning. Thank you so much for coming over. It's 2 a.m., and still you took time to come over. Thank you very much. It's our pleasure. Thank you. All right, so let me introduce the guys in front of me. We have uh, the one in guitars, Richard Barber, hey. who uh, apparently loves Asian girls, <laughs> and he just can't help it. All right. We all do. <laughs> what? We all, we all do. do. There's no apparently. There's no apparently. Okay. We have a lot of Asian girls. girls. Oh, okay, sorry for that. I thought it was just Richard. Yeah. And the, wo the voice, all right? Ladies and gentlemen, Nikhil Uzgari. I hope I hope I got your name right. Yeah, my name is Nikhil Uzgari. Mm -hmm. Uzgari. Yeah. And nako atin atin puto on base, Mr. Quay Ivano. Good morning. Good morning. Guys. <laughs> hey guys, thank you so much for coming. Really, I uh, really appreciate you. And that was one of uh, the single. Is that your career uh, single and your upcoming album? Care single. Care um, single. We're we're 
recording 10 songs as of now. Mm -hmm. The Carrier single, maybe all of them. Yeah, will hopefully. Be. Ah, hopefully. All of them. The so idea with the debut album is that each track is as strong as, it, as, strong as the others. That's what we want. So mm -hmm. if you just put it in, and any track will stand out as a great one. Mm -hmm. Hopefully, that's our intention. All right. First and foremost, I just want to ask, what's Boris and Ivy? I mean, like, where did you get the name? How did you come up with the name? And next question, if I may, one from India, one from the Philippines, one from Singapore, and one from Australia. You guys just formed a band that is so amazing. How did you guys meet up? Oh, we're like a food court. A little bit from, <laughs> little bit from no, everywhere. Really? All right, to answer the first question. Boris and Ivy comes from the name of two of my pot plants. Mm -hmm. One was called Boris and the other was called Ivy. Okay. Put them together, you get Boris and Ivy. Um, how do we meet up? Through the internet, mostly through um, ads that uh, we put up on Dubai Lime and Duke mm -hmm. Diesel from memory. And, um, oh. and then we, we met Nikhil when um, our previous vocalist pulled out of a gig. And mm -hmm. Nikhil jumped in straight away and said, you guys need a vocalist, the show's got to go on, I'm your man. He stepped right in and just mm -hmm. fitted like a, like a glove. Yeah, and that's the attitude we, we want in the band. Mm -hmm. the, the we can do attitude. Absolutely. Love that. I can Shows. see the passion, I can see the passion. See, uh, I know you've got daytime jobs, you have to wake up as early as 6 o'clock. I'm really, <laughs> you were talking, and you said I'm just doing nothing, but I was listening to what, everything that you were saying. So coming over to the studios at 2 a.m. to promote your upcoming album and I heard that you've got gigs we have everywhere basically. oh yeah we have this is this is a pretty busy month we've um we've got the Emirates Airline International Festival of Literature gig we're playing down at Dubai Festival City for that that's on the 27th mm -hmm. this Friday at 8 15 p.m. Mm -hmm. Then straight after that, we're rushing over to Touch Nightclub at Four Points by Sheraton Hotel on Bank Street for mm -hmm. the Rock Nation gig. Um, March 13th, we've got a regular slot up at Club 88 in mm -hmm. Ras Al Khaimah. And Mega Rock Nation, which is when I think, what is it, 10 bands come together? Yeah, we got around 15 bands coming together at Festival City. Mm -hmm. wow. We're going to have uh, a couple of uh, good Filipino bands from the scene as well. Mm -hmm. So it's, a, it's, it's like, a, it's, it's like a Woodstock. Uh, with oh, only that's 15 bands. I yeah, mean, around like, 15 mm. bands. And, and how many songs per band? Well, everybody gets around 40 minutes on stage to do their bit. That's really like and a Woodstock start, thing. Yeah, we start in the yeah. morning and we finish off in the night. Wow. So we want that's the acts okay. uh, basically taking part in the whole thing. It's going to be good. Yep. Amazing, amazing. Uh, I just want to ask, like, um, Asian Girls was... It's going to be one, uh, is it going to be a cut from your upcoming album? But you've got another song that is kind of uh, in my line, Lonely Lonely. Lonely Lonely Days. Lonely Lonely Days. Yeah. Like, what is the song all about? It's a song about... Who writes the songs? Uh, we, all, we all do. You all but do. mostly we, um, we author individual songs. So, for mm -hmm. example, I wrote the lyrics to Lonely Lonely Days. Mm -hmm. Quay's written the lyrics to Start. Nicky mm -hmm. wrote the lyrics to Chainsaw. These are all albums on mm -hmm. the upcoming album. So it's really a group thing. Yeah. 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 It's not just a one doing this and the other just follows what he does. No. Basically. See, I think in the first album what typically happens is there's mm -hmm. going to be one guy who writes most of it. Yeah, mm -hmm. usually people, does. people come and improvise. So I would say in this album, predominantly most of the work is Richards. Mm -hmm. We've just come in and tried to complement it by uh, improvising and doing different things to it. Mm -hmm. But uh, hopefully the second album will be a more uh, uh, more equal effort because now we kind of have understood each other's uh, way of working. We've uh, got used to each other. Mm -hmm. So now we know what it is to work together. Like, mm -hmm. So I think the second uh, album would uh, would probably have more influences uh, from everybody's uh, you know style and uh, yeah, it's, uh, yeah, it's, it's, it's basically a mix of things yeah. the second album. And